The queen waited with a lilibet cake, but was left hanging on her grandson's birthday. Queen Elizabeth II was so excited to celebrate her youngest granddaughter's first birthday that she made a cake specially for her, with a single candle, but it never went out. Welcome to Royal Expert if you're new here don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell so you don't miss any news about the British royal family. Queen Elizabeth II had 12 grandchildren, and was happy with all of them, but she was particularly touched when Prince Harry and Meghan Markle named their daughter after her. The Queen's youngest granddaughter was given the title of Lilibet. The beautiful name comes from the Queen's inability to pronounce Elizabeth correctly when she was a little girl and the name stuck. Now the name has been given to Prince Harry's daughter alongside her middle name, Diana, in a touching tribute to his mother, the late Princess of Wales. Paul Burrell, the Queen's former servant, says that after Prince Harry and Meghan moved to America, losing contact with Lilibet was upsetting for our late Queen in her final years. Despite her declining health, the Queen was determined to spend time with her baby girl and namesake. Burrell says that when the family returned to the UK for Queen Elizabeth II's Platinum Jubilee celebrations in June 2022, the Queen had not yet been able to see her granddaughter on her birthday. Even on Lilibet's first birthday, the Queen did not see her, Burrell exclusively told the Mirror. She saw them the day before. But on her birthday, the Queen had a birthday cake made out of one candle. They never showed up. That candle was never lit. The family celebrated Lilibet's birthday at Frogmore Cottage in Windsor with a picnic in the backyard. On that day, the Queen was due to attend the Epsom Derby in Surrey as part of the Jubilee celebrations, but was forced to cancel due to her ongoing mobility problems. The next day I asked them if they wanted to come for tea again and were told they had gone, Borrell recalls. What do you mean they are gone? She said. They returned to America. Oh no, they never said goodbye. Burrell says the Queen was confused by the family's minor decision to leave so quickly. How could you offend our Queen? Burrell says. Well, I don't understand anyone who could do that. Not her family, why would she? She was devoid of jealousy, anger, envy, all those traits we associate with other people that she didn't have. She was just a very simple soul. I wish the world knew her the way I knew her. Thanks for watching till the end.